Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today for Coffee Date Thursday, the topic is spring cleaning. So today I have my tiki mug that I got in Hawaii recently. I think this is the Luck Tiki. I'm not positive. I got it at the Luau we went to. It was Paradise Cove. It was awesome. Um, and inside I just have a li little bit of green tea with lemon in it. And I am going to go ahead and share with you guys two um, hacks that could be used for spring cleaning. One of them I use for spring cleaning. One of them I use for everyday cleaning using the trusty old Swiffer. So I have just a regular Swiffer sweeper. I think I got this like on sale for like $5 or something a few years ago. And this is actually something I got to help out with um, chores for the kids. So this would be one of Kaylee's chores. Um, she just dusts the floors for me so that I can go ahead and um, mop them. So that's what I bought the Swiffer for. Um, I think it is not something that you necessarily need to clean especially if you're buying like the pads and stuff for it it can get kind of expensive but for just the tool itself the starter kit you can get it for a pretty good deal so I have a Swiffer and I use this Swiffer for a few things um, the first thing I use it for is dusting the floors like I mentioned and I don't like I said buy the pads for the Swiffer so what I use is a fuzzy sock so this is just one of my old fuzzy socks it's mismatched I can't find the match for it so I use this sock um, on the Swiffer to dust the floors I just take the sock and put it over the head of the Swiffer and voila you can dust the floors with it and it does a great the, job the next thing that I use the Swiffer for is more um, a seasonal cleaning type thing I do it in the fall and usually in the spring and it is for washing walls now, if you just wash walls with a rag, um, you have to get up on a step stool to reach the tops, and it could be a long process. But I use the Swiffer to wash my walls. It makes washing the walls much easier. So what I do is I just use, I just use a rag, and I will soak the rag in um, a cleaning solution. Recently, I've just been using Lysol because I bought this big thing at Costco. So I use like less than half a cup, like maybe a quarter cup of this and um, like six cups of water. I don't know. I just kind of eyeball it just a little bit of this, just enough where it's a little bit soapy. And I soak this rag. I'll soak a rag in it and then I just clip the rag onto the Swiffer and I start at the top of the walls and I just wipe the walls down. Once I get like halfway through, I'll take the rag off, I'll wipe um, like the top parts of the door trim and then I'll rinse the rag, put it back in the solution, squeeze it out and do the rest of the wall and wipe all of my trim with the same rag. So I'll wipe all the walls and I'll wipe the baseboards and any type in the dining room I have chair rail so I'll wipe the chair rail with it and I just use one rag and a Swiffer. And it doesn't take me too long. You do have to um, pull any furniture that's on the wall like against the wall off the wall you don't want to ruin your furniture I also pull any pictures I have off the wall and then I will go ahead I dust those every time I dust but I will go ahead and give them like a good cleaning with like glass cleaner for the frame and clean them really good and before I put them back on the wall so this makes cleaning the walls much easier and much quicker and it's one of those spring cleaning tasks that I think people either dread so much they leave for last or just don't do at all and I feel like um, with the Swiffer and the rag it's a great hack to getting it done quickly and it's not as hard to do so it's not as daunting okay guys so that's it those are my two hacks for cleaning or for spring cleaning I hope that you guys enjoyed and found these helpful. Do you have any other uses for the Swiffer Mop? I think that if you put the sock on it, you could also use it to maybe clean ceiling fans. I have a ceiling fan cleaner, but I just 
thought of that. Um, but do you have any other uses for the Swiffer, any other hacks with the Swiffer mop? Share them down below in the comments. I'd love to see them. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. I'm trying really hard to reach my goal of a thousand subscribers before July. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and I can share some more cleaning tips. I have some organization videos coming up for you guys that I've been working on. That is what I mostly do for spring cleaning. I do a few tasks and then mostly just freshening up my organization. I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys. I'm gonna teach you guys how to make Puerto Rican arroz con salchichas.